Hello, my name is Farida Shaheed. I am the CEO and founder of Sukuva. Hi everyone, my name is Tizine Khan Nerilius. I am a practitioner at Morgan Franklin Cyber. Hi everyone, my name is Glenn Mastagi. I'm the VP of Strategy over at Point3 Security. Hi everybody, Trisha Howard, AKA Trisha Kick Staff here. One of the biggest changes I see happening to security programs is the community aspect. So as most of us are working from home now and we're relying on the internet and social media to connect with customers, clients, and internally with our team members, we are relying on a sense of community, a sense of a tribe. There's going to be so much compliance that is pushed through, whether it is regarding security framework implementation into your organization or whether it's regarding consumer data protection laws that are being pushed through legislation also. Even though things are starting to open back up, companies are realizing that they might not even need a brick and mortar office, which means that this work from home life could become a lot more permanent. Burnout is something that we're seeing more and more today. And the reason for that is that whenever we have basically no balance between our work and our personal life, this interferes with everything. Honestly, the security programs in the beginning were all boring. They were PowerPoint slides, and we understood that. We understood that our team members were getting annoyed with that, and they wanted something a little bit more to refresh their memory to make sure that they feel excited about something that is not normally excited. So we graduated from that to something that is more gamified. If you have any employees on your team that used to send an email response in a couple minutes or 10 minutes, but now they're doing it hours later, maybe a day later or two. Have a conversation with them, have a one-on-one -on -one with them, check in with them. And if they need a mental health day, give them a mental health day. And what that means is give them a break. Be a good employer by investing in your people. Give them constant training, whatever they need. Ask them, how can I be a good manager for you? The next step of a future change with security is having a community-based program where everyone feels like we're going through to a common goal. This is not just something that's checking a box. This is something that allows us to come together through a common goal of protecting the business so that we can service our clients a little bit better. Oh.